Hey y'all. Happy New Year. Out with 2016. Hello 2017. Yes, you're here to stay. So this video is going to be, um, I'm about to say 20, 16 things that happened to me in 2016. I wanted to do this video. I saw it. I was like, oh yes, I have to do this video. It's so much more that happened to me, but this is 16 things I can not and I'm be looking at my phone because I um, had to remember like the ones that I wanted to put in here, so I put in my phone. So let me just go to it. I should have been prepared, right? First of all, let me start off by saying I started this video upstairs. Well, I didn't start recording. I was supposed to record upstairs. I lost that good lighting, so I was like, you know what? It's not going to happen. I tried everything, but yeah. I like my shirt. It says eat, sleep, party, repeat. Okay, now I can move up some because I'll set back some because I know people probably was going to ask. What does your shirt say? So, um, yeah. What was I saying? Oh, let me get the questions. Yeah, so I started off upstairs. That wasn't working out. I was like, I got to go downstairs and get that good lighting because the lighting upstairs sucks. I can get used to this. Yeah, I go touching my hair. I had a subscriber ask me, why do female vloggers always play with their hair on camera? And I was telling her that it's like a um excuse me, it's um it's a bad habit. And not even on camera, I got a habit of doing that. And I didn't wrap my hair last night. It's already a mess, but I didn't wrap it last night. That's why my ends look off. You know. It's just a habit, and it's like a defense, not a defense, a nervous mechanism. Like, you just got to keep on touching and touching. So, I'm going to try to sit here and not touch my hair. It's going to be hard, but I want to do it. <coughs> okay, so, excuse me. Um, 16 things that happened to me in 2016. Once again, Happy New Year to everyone. I hope you guys had a wonderful New Year. Mine was awesome. I had um, so much fun. Celebrated with my family and friends. New Year's party. Um, and it was just awesome. And I know that this is going to be a good year. 2016 was an awesome year also. So, yeah. It's, it's not like I'm wheezing. It's my um, allergies. Y'all hear it like... <coughs> Y'all probably can't hear it, but it's not like... It. Okay. First thing on my list that I was proud of, that number one and the 16 things that happened to me in 2016. I got my passport. Yes, I did. I got my passport. And that go hand in hand with um, the second thing that happened to me in 2016. I got my passport and then I traveled out of the country for the first time to Jamaica. And my first time in Jamaica, Jamaica was an awesome time. If y'all didn't um, see my video about Jamaica, the pictures, I um, did videos, pictures. <coughs> um, yeah, telling y'all about my awesome time in Jamaica. And then I did um, uh, the long distance relationships work my Jamaica bag. So, yeah. Y'all go watch that after y'all watch this. That's number two. And that was an awesome time. It was so fun. Number three, I went to um, number three, I went to Virginia Beach. I always wanted to go to Virginia Beach. Never been to Virginia Beach. I've been to Virginia, but I never been to Virginia Beach. And it was lovely. I had so much fun. We stayed a week. We went to Virginia Beach, and this is the um, fourth thing that happened, we went to Ocean City, Maryland, too. I know, I've been to Ocean City, New Jersey, but I've never been to Ocean City, Maryland. So that's the fourth thing. And that was in the same time frame when I went to Virginia Beach because we stayed a week and we just went to both beach hops. Because you know, Virginia and Maryland is like right there. Um, that's one, two, three, four, fifth thing. Uh, I should have had these numbered. I really should have. Um, fifth thing, I went to uh, Bush Gardens, which is in Virginia also. So, yeah, I went to Bush Gardens. Never been. My family 
always go every year. That's like their little family vacation. And they always was like, y'all should come. So uh, 2016, we went went to um, Bush Gardens and it was fun. Um, number six, this just happened in October. I went on my first cruise and it was awesome. I went to the Bahamas. I mean, it was fun. It was awesome because of the experience. I've never been on the cruise, but it was hurricane season when we went. So the turbulence was like very bad. It was, um, is it called turbulence? Yeah, it was very bad. Um, the boat, the ship, it was so rocky. It was like horrible. Even the staff that worked there, they said um, as many as years that they worked there, over 15 years, it's never been that bad. So, yeah, we were scared, like especially the last couple days. Um so, yeah, we went to the Bahamas. We were supposed to go to Grand Turks also, but they canceled that because of the um, weather was so bad. But, yeah, that was fun. So, uh, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So, number seven goes hand in hand with my cruise experience to the Bahamas because I met one of my um, favorite social media celebrities that I like. I met Supercent. I don't know if y'all watch her. She's on Instagram, Facebook. She's very funny. Um, and her best friend, Tokyo, um, she's on Instagram as well, Facebook. And they're like really funny um, social media um, stars. And also Freaky. And they're all friends. And I met all of them. So that's why the experience was like, oh, that's my kid. That's why the experience was so fun because... Uh, she invited us to the cruise and that's what made me go. And I always wanted to go to the Bahamas and I love traveling. So why not? And that's why I said the experience was awesome because even though we had a bad time with the, um, cruise, like the border and everything, thinking we were going to die, we had fun with them. So that was good. And that was number six, right? That was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was seven. <clears throat> I really should have labeled these. Um, number eight, this goes hand in hand with the cruise also because I went to Miami for the first time. And um, we had to go to Miami in order to go to the cruise because that's where the ship was docked. That's where we, um, that's where the port was in Miami. So I went to Miami and in Miami, I got to go to my, um, not my favorite, but um, a place I wanted to go to, the Sugar Factory. I always wanted to go there, and that's like a place where all the celebrities go. They have like all these candy, fruity drinks. They sell food, and it's expensive, and it was so much fun, though. I went there, and Miami was a good time. I'm going back to Miami. Miami was so fun. Um, the scenery is gorgeous. Go to Miami, you're not going to want to come back. I love, love, love it. And it's hot. It's warm. So that was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I know y'all probably like, why she can't keep up? I really can't because I talk to it. And then that was eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It just seemed like more because everything's going hand in hand with the I did with the stuff that I've done. So number nine. Yeah, number nine. I started shopping at Torrid. I know you're probably like, girl, but I did. I really didn't never like I never really cared for Torrid. I never it was in a store that I was like I had to shop at. And I felt like it was so overrated. A lot of people always talked about Torrid. And like one of my friends, like she lived by that store. But I never um, cared for it. But I started top shopping at Torrid, and I, I'm kind of liking it. Um, I got this shirt from Forever 21, though. This shirt is old. Only wore it, like, this is probably my third time wearing it. But it's so old. Um, Number nine, I tried new foods. I started trying new foods. Like, I'm a really, really picky eater. Um, I never used to, like, like, Years ago, like I've been eating greens for a while, but I never used to like greens, um, ham. What else? My family used to be like, "Where did you come from? Why did you eat that stuff?" 
And I still don't eat stuff like green peppers. I don't eat green peppers. I don't eat onions. Like if I get a whole key, it's just going to have lettuce, um, meat, cheese, and mayonnaise. That's it. And pickles. I don't get none of that stuff. Tomatoes, anything. I don't eat any of that stuff. Um, and I'm scratching because, as y'all know, Forever 21 and a dumb tag. I usually cut it off, but when you cut it off, it seems like it's even worse. Um, yeah, I started trying the foods because I'm one to be scared to try the foods, but I started trying new foods. Um, that was number nine, I think. Two, four, six, eight. Nine. That was ten. So eleven, I um finally went to paint with a Swiss. Oh my goodness, yes, I finally went. My friend invited me to um her friend's birthday party and it was paint with a Swiss and it was fun. It's not somewhere where I will like go off in, but it's a nice relaxing time. And if y'all don't know what paint with a Swiss is, you can bring your own bottle of wine or whatever kind of um, alcohol or beverage you want to um, bring. You can bring food, snacks, whatever you want to bring, and you paint. And they have like a little outlining for um, the instructor. They have like an outlining of what you're going to paint and just paint it. And it's $35. But yeah, it's $35 and you um, book your seat and stuff online. That's fun. It's nice to have a, like, a party there. So that was fun. And about me talking, I forgot what number I was on. It's so sad. I'm so sorry. I should have had this. I really should have had these numbered. Uh, Y'all can tell I'm used to doing fashion and not stuff like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Why didn't I have these numbered? I didn't think I would um have to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12. Now, I'm going to keep my hand on here. 12. Um, I met new people. And that go hand in hand with the crews and stuff. So, I met some new I met some new um, cool people um, from the crews. And I met them, like, through. Because we all, like, um, Super Tokyo and all of them. So, we met, like, talking on um, social media and stuff before the cruise and then we actually got to meet and it was a good time and we still keep in contact so that was nice yeah so I met some new people and um yeah it's always good meeting new people yes so what else um that was and I got my hand here and I still forgot where I was at this is sad y'all I know y'all gonna talk about me one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12. That was 12. Okay. Number 13. Uh, I met my idol for the zillion time. And that's just what I said over there. I met my idol for the zillion time. But I don't think that was in 2016. I believe it was in 2016, but I'm not sure. It don't seem like it was in 2016. It seemed like it was before that. But I'm going to say it was in 2016 because as I go back and I go back to the pictures and social media, it was 2016. Um, um, I went to Brandy's. Um, I went to New York. She was doing her first play, um, Roxy playing Roxy Hart, and the play was phenomenal. And she's did it. She um, did it again. Um, and what did I say? Chicago? Yeah. Chicago. So, yeah. The play, I think she did it again in Chicago. And the play is also Chicago, Roxy Hart. Um, yeah, so that was a fun time. And me and her had a blast. Oh, y'all already saw that. I had that one here also. Go check that out. Um, it's, I think it's titled Brandy's Biggest Fan or something like that. And if y'all didn't know, yes, Brandy is my idol. And I don't think I said that when I said met my idol for the zillion time. Y'all should just know that. Yes. So, yeah. When I say the zillion time, I mean the zillion time. And my mom and all my friends always say, stop saying you met her. You didn't meet her again. Like, you already know her. She knows you. But anywho, I met her for the zillion time. So, that was awesome. And that was number 13. That was number 14. It had to be 14. I think I skipped the number. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
That was 13. So number 14. And these are all, um, hey, mommy. Hey, Gadget. That's my cat, Gadget. Hey, mama. Hey, mommy. Hey, mama. Y'all want to see Gadget? This is Gadget. Hmm, hey, mama. Isn't she cute? She a teacup cat. She's more like a, a coffee cup. A coffee mug. Look, mommy. Look at the camera. Say hi. Isn't she so pretty? My baby. Come on. Oh, kid, yeah. Oh, mommy. Mm -hmm. I love me and I love her, right, mama? Right. This is all y'all gonna get because if y'all ever was to come to my house, y'all will never see her. She is so scary. She is scared of people. The only people she's not scared of is me. My mom and my mom boyfriend. But everybody else, she is scared. Right, mom? They never get to see her and she's so gorgeous and her show fit. But I so fit. I so fit and fluffy. Yes, I am. See, she hears her. Can I get that, mommy? Go ahead, go see what that is, mom. Okay, y'all. So, um, yeah. She got me sidetracked. Um, number, um, hey, Prince. No, that's my cat, Prince. Hey, Prince. Hey, Prince. I have fur all in my face. Hey, mommy, good boy. Is that fur? Oh, that's my lip gloss. Come on, something on my face. Um, number 15, I cut some people out of my life for the good. So all these are like good things that happen to me and some are bad and some are even better. But yeah, I cut people out of my life and it felt so good. I mean, I'm touching my hair and I'm only touching it because I'm fixing it. See, I'm just fixing it. Um, yeah, I cut some people out of my life and... Yeah, they're cut, so that's the end of that. That felt good. Um, number number fifteen. Fifteen, yeah, it was this one is sad. Some um death and it was family and um we might as well say family because they were so close, like close friends, that they were family. It was actually three people that, um, like, basically was like a shocker. So that's what happened in 2016. I know it was one year that it was just like death back to back all around. It was like a bad, bad year for me. And that was in 2009. Like, I could not wait for that year to go. Like, I remember that like it was just that. That year was so bad that it seemed like it was like a um, domino effect. That's how it was. And I, and it was close to the new year. And I just could not wait for that year to be out. Like I was like praying for that year to go. And I never, um, I never was like that. But I um, only had 15 on here. So 16, I'm going to say that I started, um, doing more videos i believe like 2016 my videos i started being more um consistent with my videos <clears throat> yes because i enjoy doing this and i just love you guys and i just love getting these videos out so yeah 2016 even though it's not like um consistent like i said i would be but y'all gotta remember that i do have a job as well so i do work so i really don't have time to really doing like that but there is the video's been consistent like if you look back from um last year not last year 2016 2015 you will see that um i've been pushing out more videos this year last year 2016 y'all know what i mean but anyway that was 16 things that happened to me in 2016 so that's um my damn cat 
her fur is like tickling my nose. I got allergies so bad. Not even supposed to be having kids. <coughs> That's why my ass is wheezing now. But anywho, um, if y'all like this video, give it a thumbs up, like it, um, subscribe to my channel, of course. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Um, share this video on all your social medias. Um, comment and just tell me how you liked it. If you like it, if you want to see more videos like this, just let me know and I will do them. So until next time, wait well, once again, happy new year. Make sure that y'all make this year, make the best out of this year. Put it like that. So whatever you want to do, do it. And until next time, ciao. See you guys. Bye.